Welcome back, fellow Vuperians, to Hearts of Iron 4, where we have been fighting hard to keep our country and our citizens safe from the, well, literal communists, including Brazil, who are really trying to give us a bad time. I mean, come on, Brazil. You should be a little bit nicer. You're, you're, you're causing everyone a lot of issues. Uh, thankfully, the French are actually doing a fantastic job of pushing Brazil back. And Brazil is uh, doing their best to stop that. So we'll see what happens there. I don't think they're going to be able to stop Brazil on their own. I think it's going to be an absolute mess after the initial push of the French falls back. But I'm not in control of it. So there's no real way for me to know if it's going to go well or not. Uh, we'll see. I don't think it's gonna go well. <laughs> Let's ramp up our production. Yeah, yep. See? The French, they, they lost the capital. Brasilia's. Oh, the French are getting encircled so hard! Oh, I actually feel bad. That's so. That is. That is a really intense encirclement there. Oh boy. Uh. Oh, the French. You're in a little bit of trouble if you let them do that. Yikes. Okay. Um, we're going to ignore that because that's none of our business. What's going on in China? We've we've been uh, helping out here in China. It's a slow and steady push, but we are actually making a little bit of progress, which is good. We have 7% war participation in something that we've never really been invested in, so that's always good. We have 21% in this war. What is the- Oh, this is someone against China. That's why it's so high. So, we're doing well in the Gabonese Vuparist War. Why is everything against us? Why is it a Vuparist War? I never got in the way of the Gabonese. Where- Where is Gabon? Uh... There they are. What 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 is your problem? Do I do I have to like blockade you with the very few ships I have? Oh, looks like they're already doing it, or my allies are. Good enough. Happy with that. Thank you. Uh oh, the French are once again letting themselves get cut off. I don't know why their strategy is just failing so hard right now. Guys, you gotta pick it up. Uh, now something good we can do is we can start building up infrastructure in the Middle East. And that is going to supply us with a lot of oil. Building up the infrastructure in like one of these. Well, once that, I'll show you guys what it does. If we zoom in here, just building this infrastructure here is going to give us 126 more. Oh, jeez. Vietnam joined the African Alliance of Racial Supremacy. Now that, that sounds like a headache. So, things are looking pretty good. Oh, Vuperia is actually not looking good. The Chinese are actually pushing us back a little bit. That's nerve-wracking. Let's move back so that we reconnect our lines. I don't like retreating. Oh, okay, go that way, actually. I don't really care. Just get your lines in order. Are we going to have to retreat? We may have to pull a tactical retreat. They're, they're trying to encircle us. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. How's, how's this going? Okay, cancel your current attack orders. Focus on defense right now. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is actually quite bad. How are we going to pull this off? Uh, we're low on supply. That's the issue. And that's because we're cut off. Oh, no. We're cut off. Oh, come on. to Tajik stand. I, I really need your help right now. Can you give me military access? No, you can't. Hey, you want to become really good friends real quickly? Uh... Uh, improve relations. Great. Oh, what just happened? Treaty of the Port of Spain. Oh, shoot. Who just... 
Oh, Gabon and Cameroon, all of you guys who were attacking me, you've all given in. Fantastic, that sounds fun. I'm going to enjoy taking your land. Okay, we're... Oh, the Honduras. That... That is very valuable to us. That is very valuable to us indeed. We're going to take the Honduras. They're so close to our land. It just makes sense. Oh, my Australia. Okay, I think we're going to take over Australia. That, that sounds fun. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. Hey, Australia, you're Vuperian now. Ah, they took a piece of my Australia. That makes me very unhappy. Whoa, they took another... Okay, so I guess Australia is just split in half now. Fine. Fine. Fine, fine. Australia is now half Vuperian. I honestly thought it said Austria. I didn't think it said Australia. Palestine. Guess we're taking Palestine as well then. Do we not have enough? Oh, there we go. Wait. We don't have enough points. Yes! I own, like, the most unstable region of the world now. Let's go. Okay, I think uh, we're doing pretty well considering. I mean, this is gonna get more complicated now because we own all these areas which we can't really defend in any way. Wow, Russia is invading. Oh, China won against India. So now Russia is inside of China. Interesting. You guys are kind of doomed if that guy doesn't pull this off. Please pull. Yes. Okay. Okay. No, not all of you. Yeah, you dummies. You're staying put. Because if you don't stay put, you're going to run out of supply and die. Okay? You're going there. You're going there. We got to get out of here. We have to connect our lines. How is our diplomacy going over here? Wow! Y you like me plus 10. Can we please get that number up a little bit? Thanks. Plus 13. Yeah, we're gonna have to speed things up a little bit faster there. My men are literally dying. Uh, I need to get supply through. How are the military factories going? Pretty good. What are we going to focus on? Military industrial complex. Ah, that kills our stability though. What will help our stability? Hmm. We can go in that direction or that direction, but we can't. So we're going to take a balanced. Oh, we already did that. So we can either do Democratic or Republican, but we're neither. Ha ha. So we can't actually do any of that. I guess we're gonna build, uh, new alliances then. That's expensive, but probably worth it. I am going to push a force attack. That's gonna push it over that drain. 98! Come on! 99! Yes! Reconnected! Let's see if that force attack will give us enough power to push through here as well. If we can cut them off... Ah, oh, shoot, they moved. There goes our supply again. They're giving me some real trouble, but we could win this battle over here if we're careful. We can fight from below as well. We're gonna go from every side. Come on, 86. Oh, jeez. Uh, Japan is looking towards, uh, taking over other people now. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. This is so sad. Okay, let's go ahead and... I don't know what we're gonna do here. We've gotta try to expand out as much as possible. 
while keeping ourselves safe. Uh, this is this is a risky one here. Our military. Oh, they're falling back. Oh no, 92. If we can get that up to 100, we'll be safe, probably. Uh, 94, 95. This is such a small thing here, too. It's like this tiny little battle, but so much hinges on it. We need to keep control in China. Okay. This is gonna be fast over here. You guys, you have a very simple offensive line. You're just pushing to the back of Panama. Great. We're gonna declare war on Panama. Hey, how's it going? I declare war on you. Bam. Wow, Panama joined them. Who would have thought they would get help? Yeah, for some reason, I don't think Panama stands much of a chance. Even though I'm not even fighting out of my own land, which means it should be more challenging. Um, they're, they're not doing too good. Important decisions available. Uh, expand, expand, expand. Dodd-Frank plan. Space stability up! Nice! Okay, nice. Let's do that. Sounds good. Stability is good. North Korea, for some reason, is fighting with us, so they're good right now. Let's go ahead and pull some troops back. And by back, I mean really back. We're gonna try to make this a very painless and simple retreat. Very nice. They've capitulated. Great! So now, I think we're pretty much safe when it comes to Central America. Uh, Belize won't attack us, and Korean Mexico won't, the Honduras won't, Costa Rica won't. I, I think we're pretty much all together, and we can take those all over in the future. Um, we're working our best to push down, though. But oh boy, in China, things are very different. I think we've actually lost a few divisions. We're having a very bad day in China. I think, I, I think we're going to... How can we escape? Okay, you stay right where you are. You guys all group up. Uh, I think we may be doomed when it comes to China. There's too many of them. Oh, we're completely surrounded. This isn't going to end well for us. This is going to end quite poorly for us. Okay, bam, more research. We've already re- come on. There's gotta be something I can research. Okay, naval. Corvette 3, fantastic. Uh-oh. We are being attacked. Go, go. I am not very happy with the current situation. Okay, that's it. We need we need to back everyone up into the same area. Build a fort and pray. Uh, in that order. Build fort. Where are we staying? There. Okay, build a fort. A whole lot of forts right there. We're gonna stay in there as long as we can. Hail Vapiria, indeed. Yes. At some point, one of our allies should come to save us. But right now, we just don't have the resources to fight China. We're going to have to make this a defensive ordeal. And it'll take a long time for them to successfully, uh... Push through against us. I think we're safe in that regard. I can't be sure though. This is a really risky uh, move over here because we are kind of giving them us in a little bubble.
We only have 27 divisions because we've been dealing with some slight bureaucratic problems. I mean, under recruit and deploy, we don't have enough manpower or light mechanized, light mechanized, light mechanized. Yeah. That's, that's our issue. Uh... Actually, we have a lot of people who are about to be deployed, though, so hopefully that goes well. Uh, we had to come out of a massive civil war and stuff, though, so our military is not quite where it should be. I don't know, could we get these men and get out? That would be a really challenging uh, move. Czech Republic wants to sign a non-aggression pact with us. How's it going over here? Pretty well. Our men are moving up as quickly as they can. Okay, how are the forts going? I need to put them at the top of the list. Okay, fantastic. So they should be pretty safe. For now. We are losing the Middle East, which is an absolute mess. Uh, I will be honest. That is not good in any way. It looks like Brazil is being pushed back by pretty much everyone at the same time. Gonna be honest. Um, that's rather interesting. Thankfully, we've got all these beautiful things helping us out. Oh, we've got even more people! Yes! Our military is growing so quickly, it makes me proud. Okay, back to 24 people. That makes up for all of the losses we took. That's pretty, uh, beneficial. Oh, even more! Now we can start a second of- oh, a lot more. Oh, whoops, I may have split that one apart a little bit, but that's okay. There we go. New guy, you're going to go to Canada. Can I invade Canada? No. They are much more uh, powerful than me right now, but we can make it work in the future. The Freedom League. Wow. No, that's lame. That's a really lame, lame name. We're going to create the United Federations, thank you. Uh, there's a way to do it, too. Millennium Chaos. Oh, that's the settings. Where is it where we make our... Okay, first off, we have to choose something for this. So, strengthen ties with Russia. Oh, or the EU. Ah, that's a challenging one. I feel like NATO's just gonna get in the way, so... Actually, I'm gonna go with the EU because we're messing with... Oh, I can't. I can't. I have to be friends with Russia. Never mind, then. Okay, that's fine. What next? Read the chat. One second, I'm busy watching China get eaten by revolutionary Myanmar in North Korea. Looks like China's finally going to collapse. There's nothing left of you. Poor, poor Japan. Got cut in half by Russia. <laughs> this is sad. Why do they like me so much? Ah, because we guarantee them. Okay. So, we can- oh, we can have them be friend. Ah! I don't know what I just pressed. That was bad. Okay, boost party popularity in Japan as well. I don't have enough political power to do that. China is over party. This is it. This is the China is over party. Shanghai still stands for literally everything else in China is falling apart. Why couldn't they have fought like this when our men were there? They could have saved us. Okay, we've strengthened our ties with Russia. That's good. That's always nice. 
American Russian Alliance. Actually, hey, you know that revolution thing I was planning? We're gonna just cancel that because we have a better way to do it now. Cancel. Great. Nice. Thank you, Russia, for not making me, like, destroy you in order to become friends with you. We're just becoming friends anyways. Okay, uh, China is almost non-China. It's, uh, got, I think, 1% left. Oh! It's over! That's it. That's it. Wow. India is so messed up. Okay. Hey, that's over. So we actually have a lot of things that we can take from this war. Um, Brazil wasn't this war. Okay, that's sad. What can we take? Only China? Is it just China? Oh. Nothing to take. Oh my god, they already did everything. Oh, we got nothing out of this. Wow, this is sad. This is really sad. We got literally nothing. Okay. Even though we gave up all of that. Well, that's sad. Uh, Russia still owns part of India. Okay. Well, guys, I get... Oh, look at that. We got a little bit up here. China got moved east. China has really moved east got kind of squashed okay well I can't complain we've got our Middle Eastern areas back um Buberia is doing well this has been a met whoa South America has been completely reverted back to what it was before that's insane as well well, guys, I guess that's going to be it for this time. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you want to support Vuperia. And I will see you all next time. We're gaining manpower. We're gaining stability. And we're gaining factories. We are becoming a major world player again. And it's probably going to be us who starts the next major war. And we'll come out on top. Bye.